Three students share a birthday on the same day. Quinn and Ralph are the same age, but Audrey is two years older. The product of their ages is 11,548 greater than the sum of their ages. In Part A, find polynomial functions that represent the age product and the age sum. We'll use x to represent the ages of Quinn and Ralph. Audrey is two years older, so her age is x plus 2. The product of the three ages is x times x times x plus 2. As a polynomial function, this is p of x equals x squared times x plus 2. The sum of the three ages is x plus x plus x plus 2. As a polynomial function, this is p of x equals 3x plus 2. In part b, write a polynomial equation that can be used to find the age of each person. The question specifies that the product of their three ages is 11,548 greater than the sum of their ages. The product of the ages is equal to the sum of the ages plus 11,548. The product of the ages is x squared times x plus 2, and the sum of the ages is 3x plus 2. On the left side of the equation, multiply the factors to get x cubed plus 2x squared. Add the constants to get 11,550. The polynomial equation is x cubed plus 2x squared minus 3x minus 11,550 equals 0. In part c, use a graphing calculator to solve the polynomial equation from part b. Indicate your window settings. How old is each person? We can solve this equation by graphing x cubed plus 2x squared minus 3x minus 11,550 and locating the x-intercepts. If we graph the polynomial using the standard window settings, we don't see any part of the graph. If we use zoom fit, we still don't get an x-intercept. Change x max to 30 and reapply zoom fit. We can now see the x intercept. Use the zero command to get the x-intercept of 22, 0. Quinn and Ralph are 22, since x equals 22. Audrey is 2 years older, so she is 24.